Hello, I'm Martin Fenska and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Battle Brothers. So for the last few days I didn't have basically any time for games, so I'll have to recap a little bit what happened during the, uh, like the previous episode. I think it was a pretty good one, we made some money and at the end we arrived to Waldmark and found some potentially decent recruits. And now I have to decide whom are we gonna try. And I think I'll listen to you guys because someone suggested that I should probably uh, take Volmar even though he's the most expensive one, but it's the best background and uh, very often I am struggling finding hunters, uh, which is true, definitely. Uh, the other option would be probably like testing Geralt together with Vigmar, we would try both of them, but um, I mean, Boyer it's a background that I would want to replace eventually, I think, unless uh, it would be like an exceptional, uh, exceptional character, like three-star range defense and something on top of that even. So that's very unlikely. I want to get one boyer at some point so that I can get the masterwork bow, but here, if I'm deciding between hunter and the boyer, I think I will take the hunter. Also, girl uh, has only a short bow, so I would have to get the replacement for that, so it's another investment. And um, Wildman, again, Wildman could be good, but the chance that he would stay in the company forever is quite low. Uh, so, yeah, let's, let's just try the Hunter. There is the highest chance that's gonna be like a permanent member of the company long term. Um, fingers crossed, that's a lot of money right now. Okay, be good. Nope. Oh, we don't have to worry about resolve. 52 is more than enough for an archer. Wait, one star range skill. We are talking plus 35, I think, in average on level 11. So like 90-ish, which for hunter is actually pretty bad. six fatigue don't think we have to invest into fatigue i think i want to invest into hit points a little bit eight starting range defense isn't horrible so if we get like exceptional rolls all the way to level 11 he could stay in the end but i don't think that's likely hmm that is unfortunate because 1500 that was a lot of money but well he's here so uh, he's gonna stay for a while, it's not like I can replace him. Okay, level ups, that's another thing that we got last time. So let's check those out. Uh, Hardbird is uh, throwaway. For throwaways, I'll just take rotation. <clears throat> Plus three. I don't want to take range defense. If I take too much range defense for my throwaways, uh, the AI is just gonna start shooting at people that I don't want to get hit. So we want their range defense to stay quite low. Uh, we can take initiative, I think, and we can take hit point. Actually, no, let's skip that. 40, 50, um, 50 resolve is decent. Okay, let's take the initiative hit points and melee defense. Then Lothar. Lothar is definitely going to stay with the company for a while, if he survives, of course. So we want to start with a student and go plus four. Excellent, plus four. Five and I th oh those are some pretty damn good numbers. I think initiative, considering what he's supposed to do, no matter if he's gonna end up with a dagger, polearm, or a whip, we want him to be fast. So let's take the initiative. Then uh, Volmar, that's gonna be student and please no, it's plus three. Please the range defense is good. Uh, resolve is fine, stamina is okay-ish, and then we have plus three and plus three. I will take hit points only when it's plus four, so it's initiative. Uh, then Henrik. Henrik is supposed to be the tank surgeon thingy that we don't know if it's gonna work, but I'm gonna start with the student anyway. And we want to take melee defense, we want to take resolve, and we want to take something else. What's it gonna be? I guess hit points. 
You know, I need some fatigue here and there. I don't really care about initiative. I think if I want to take hit points. Oh, it's only plus two fatigue, never mind. Okay, we definitely want to take hit points in that case. One, two, three there. And Halstein, that's another throwaway, so rotation. And plus three, plus four, plus three. He's supposed to be a stun bot, so I want him to be as fast as possible. Good. And where do we go? I decided to go north because uh, there is a, an ambition to visit all cities on the map and who knows when are we gonna return to the north because I don't want to spend too much time in the north so let's just take advantage of the fact that we are already here we're gonna check all the northern towns and then go south again um how is it called gerborg let's start it there is there anything that I oh there is something that i missed someone asked me if i could check the retinue um well i'll have to do that when we get closer to town because i can't recruit any anyone in the middle of nowhere but even near a town i can't do or i can't recruit anyone because it's just too expensive the cheapest uh, like i think they're called followers um i i think 2000 and uh, the cheapest one that i would like to get is two and a half oh, what is this Many raiders, few marksmen. Okay, nothing that we want to uh, attack. Maybe even nothing that we want to get too close to. Uh, perfect. First ambition fulfilled. So suddenly the company is a little happier. Uh, what was I talking about? Oh, the retinue. Uh, so the the cheapest one, I think it's a cartographer. That's uh, the, the name of the background or the follower. Uh, it's two and a half thousand. What he does is that when you find a location, he pays you for that between 100 and 400 gold, which is great this early. And he would pay for himself quickly, I think. Uh, but in order to, can we see it? Oh, we are close enough. Okay, cartographer. In order to get access to him, we have to find a legendary location. So this is the first one I think I'll try to get. And then Bounty Hunter is great, but as you can see, it's gonna take a while. And other than that, other than that, it's something that you want to take advantage of when you have enough money, when you can afford to like throw away a few thousand and you don't really feel it. Uh, I'm not saying that they are bad, I'm saying throw away some money. It's not really throwing away money, but the return on the investment is a pretty long term and often it's like uh, like quality of life things rather than um, an investment that you would get back. So it's gonna take a while until I start uh, using the retinue, except for the cartographer, as I said, and I will try to get, but it all depends on how long it's gonna take us finding the first legendary location. So yeah, that's the retinue. Mm. Gerborg. We need, what do we need? We need tools and supplies, we need food. This is not the horrible town. That's weaponsmith, armor. I'm just curious if there's something interesting. No, it's quite a few recruits. Oh, they have a. Sc oh, I made a mistake. I should have. Well, it's easy to say now that it was a mistake recruiting the hunter. I had no idea what we're gonna find here. So I definitely tried the squire. I really like squires' as background. Oh well. Okay, how much do you guys want? Uh, 244. Uh, I kind of have to. And uh, 
not much variety when it comes to food, but again, can't afford it anything more fancy. Fine. Uh, why am I even checking the gear when I can't afford it anything? Okay, where do we go now? We can check the tavern. Kalk. Uh, Kalk is here. So I guess we go north through Kalk to Fielstein and then Hellehovel and Gunspira. That's a weird name. Okay, go. Oh, well, what was that? Nine barbarians. I think we are interested. They're just thralls. How are we doing? So, that's not great. Maybe I could do something like this. It's a weird. Oh, wait, no. no. Ah, this is a reserve. For a moment, I thought I was still in Legends and I had three rows available. Okay, this will have to do then. And go. Do we want to find them in the forest? Oh, there are even more. Oh. Um, okay, we... I don't think we'll be able to take the high ground. I think those dogs... Oh, there's just one. Maybe... Let's see... Um, I might be able to... No, 19% is not gonna happen. Yeah. Yeah, I'd love to get the high ground. Also love to hit something. <clears throat> Anything. Is this gonna work? At least I prevent most of them from going up. Okay, I may need some help here. next Now I have to figure out how I stop this guy from throwing more spears. Because those spears hurt.
Oh, that was a lucky shot. Wasn't too bad. Probably took a little bit more damage than he should have, but uh, twenty-nine. Oh, that's nice. That this is easily gonna pay for the repairs, and we even gonna make some. I think what we get from the neck for the necklace is just pure profit. Uh, just the same thing again, but I'm not sure. We are ready for another fight at this point. Could use a few hours to fix everything. Okay, level ups. I'm not sure that I want to take uh, X mastery or any weapon mastery. So I think I'll go with brawny because eventually Erhard wants to have brawny. It's not super useful right now, but we know that we want that perk. So. I will take it. And then plus three, plus three, plus three, I guess. And Grimald. Well, here we want to take a weapon mastery. And plus four, plus four, plus five. Holy crap! Grimald got uh, got the uh, maximum rolls every single time. I think he did. Yeah, we need some healing. Let's go back to Gerborg. Um, how much are you guys paying? 260? I'll take that. Even thinking about setting up a camp 10 hours yeah 10 hours is a long time I also don't want to waste time We can set up camp here for a few hours. So let's see how we're doing. Oh, we're doing really well. Maybe we can just check the contract. Sotel. Sotel is way too far. It's a nice reward, but three days. I don't think we are quite ready to uh, escort anything for three days. Because we can't even reliably kill 
uh, raiders. So that's way too risky. Need to heal those injuries. Uh, two to four days, six to fifteen medical supplies. I mean, if you have that, you're just gonna take some time. Whoa, two shops really village in the middle of nowhere, and they have a Fletcher and the armor here. And they want only 190 for tools and supplies. Actually, I think I should buy that. Not that I don't need it right now. We don't have that much money. But 190, that's a steal. How much time do we have? Four days? I'm just curious. Of course, we can't afford to buy anything, but... I always like to look up there and staff foresight at the Tomb of the Forefathers. Uh, no, I don't think we want to do this. That sounds way too much like either fallen heroes, ghosts, or or even how they called uh, necrosavants. Let's try to find some more thralls with some dogs. If we could get um, another necklace, that would be great. And it's quite safe as well. Maybe I should have attacked the other group. Another pretty decent city. But this looks like a capital, so maybe I shouldn't be surprised that they have some shops here. And again, cheap tools and supplies. Maybe we will visit these cities a bit more often than I thought. Thinking if we can afford it to go this way or if I have to follow the road. It's not the best time, but we could go like here, maybe camp for an hour or two and then climb the mountain, have a look around. Okay, we don't want to take the battle standard yet, because we have to pay for it, and I don't want to make 2,000 and immediately lose 1k. What's this one? Buy and sell 20, no, don't care. It doesn't say anything about recruiting a follower. No, it says uh, that then higher and uh, never mind. Ah. Uh. It's not pretty bad. All of these. 
eight contracts that could take forever. Okay, well, I guess we will go for that standard. That's the easiest one to do, unfortunately. Uh, we go around and climb the mountain maybe we don't have to climb the mountain at all um, we're actually much healthier now at least we are not missing that many hit points This is tempting. Oh, there are some tracks. Uh, maybe this is safer. Come on. Don't run too far. I don't have time for this. Thralls. A reaver. Can we handle a reaver? We should be able to handle one reaver. Wait, I'm not sure that I want to activate Spear Wall. I may just want to move to them because otherwise they'll just start throwing weapons. Spears, what do they have? Both spears and axes? No, just spears. Well, okay, I'll just move forward. Wait, wait. Let's try this one. Honestly, I expected that to be worse. Just, we have to do something that he can't keep attacking us over and over again. What's the chance here? 36, 31. Should probably try to kill the throne, never mind. <gasps> no, and that's a problem. Yep, that's just... <sighs> wow. Okay, I didn't expect that. Problem is he goes first again, and I have a feeling this is gonna be bad. Wow, damn, that was lucky. Now I just have to do something about the the river and. May even somehow survive this. I just need him to panic, honestly. Come 
Come on. Come on. There we go. Oh, not even close. Okay, what did we get? Was it worth it? Uh, food, 100 gold. 260 for Ember Shards. Some of the weapons. How much is the helmet? The helmet should be worth a little bit. And actually, the helmet is probably something we should keep. Okay, who gets the helmet? I'm not sure that I want to repair this one. Probably should. Okay, level ups. Lothar, no matter what he's gonna be using in the end, I want him to have Pathfinder, I'm pretty sure. So let's take that. One, two. That's a maximum initiative, so I'll take that. I think I'll uh, try to get some extra hit points, but not when I get the max initiative. And here, that's gonna be a rotation. One. I will take Resolve. Probably Stamina. Okay, how much money? 537 tools and supplies. But we need 20 hours to fix everything. Only food for two days. So we have to get to Gunspira. That's a weird name. Gunspira as soon as possible. I think I'll pass on this. Because we took too much damage. I was just Erhard who took damage. Problem is that Erhard is the main source of damage. So. Can we make it? I really doubt it. Okay, let's set up a camp. Wait till the morning. I hope we get a decent price for the for the Ember Shards. Two seventy three, I'll take that. Suddenly we are in pretty decent shape. Just food, that, that's what we need. Um, food, more food. 208 is a pretty good price, but we can't afford it. And we don't need it, so I think... Why am I even looking at the recruits? I think we are done with this episode. I'm honestly tempted to return to this graveyard next time. And I think I'm gonna do it. Because last time we got a ton of money. And I wouldn't mind getting, what was it, like 2000 again. It wasn't that difficult. We are now 
um, a little bit stronger. We have more people. How are we doing here? 43 hit points. Yeah, we could use some extra healing, but we will heal a little bit on the way north. Only one injury. Yeah, I think we will attack the graveyard next time. But we are done with this episode, so I hope that you liked it. I hope that you're going to join me next time again. And until then, have a good time. Bye-bye.